Ekadeshi falls in the month of Vaishak that is April to me. It is also known as Vaishak Krishna Ekadeshi. It is believed that whosoever observes a complete fast on this sacred day has his sins completely removed, attains continuous happiness and achieves all good fortune. Giving the daughter away as a dhan on her wedding that is kanya dhan is termed as the most absolute dhan a person can give to anyone in this world. However, this Varudhani Ekadashi vrat gives a person similar fruits to a hundred kanya dhan. Now let's see Varudhani Ekadashi vrat katha. Pandava king Yudhishthir asked Sri Krishna to narrate the significance of Varudhani Ekadashi vrat. Sri Krishna narrated that there lived a king named Mandata who ruled a kingdom on the banks of the river Narmada. He was benevolent and spiritually inclined. Once when the king was meditating in a jungle, a wild bear attacked him. But since he did not want his meditation to get disrupted, he prayed to Lord Vishnu to save him. Pleased with his devotion, Lord Vishnu appeared and killed the bear with his Sudarshan chakra. Mandata, who was always kind and helpful, thanked Lord Vishnu for saving him but wondered why the bear attacked him. Lord Vishnu said that he was punished for one of his wrong doings during his previous birth. The Lord also asked Mandata to visit Mathura and observe the Varudhani Ekadashi vrat to treat his injuries. The king thanked the Lord and sincerely observed the vrat in the holy city of Mathura. Devotees observe the Varudhani Ekadashi vrat for protection. Lord Vishnu guards and protects all those who keep this vrat and worship him on the Ekadashi tithi. Om Narayanaya Vidmahi Vasudevaya Dhimahi Tanno Vishnu Prachodaya Reciting this is said to benefit devotees largely. Chanting the Hare Krishna Maha Mantra 108 times is also said to reap rich benefits and bring about a certain calming effect on the body. Chanting the Vishnu Sahasranama and Vishnu Chalisa also benefits the devotees. Hare Krishna